Well, they have a mixed review when it comes to having to wear a mask to get back inside Capitol Books. Take a look at this sign before you enter. It says, because we have families with yet to be vaccinated children, we still require that everyone entering wear a mask that covers both your mouth and nose. And take a look when you go inside. The first thing you see is a display of books about the pandemic to educate their guests about why it's so important to wear a mask, not to just to protect yourself, but others. When I spoke with the owner, Ross Roject, he says he knows personally how COVID can affect children. He says one of his four-year-old customers had to miss story time last week due to catching COVID and having severe symptoms for seven days. Roject says he wishes that the county would make masking a mandate instead of a recommendation to give businesses support during this time when customers do not want to comply. Because, you know, they blame us. You know, I, I get the eye roll or, you know, we get yelled at for making somebody wear a mask for the two minutes it takes them to come in, grab their thing and go. Um, so it's helpful if we can roll it up and say, well, the county has mandated it. Rojek says one third of his employees are high risk. So wearing a mask protects them and the customers that come in and out of the store.